Hello K tribe. I choose to live in a farm in Africa. So it's Saturday on 20th. Yeah, a day after Good Friday. I'm not really feeling well, but I felt like I should update you. Like Hello, Kate. Hi. Guess where we are going? <laughs> we are going home. So we've left Nairobi at 11. Now we are on our way home. We are the back benches. Say hi. Hi. Drink your food. She's drinking. Just a 10 minute break for to go to the loo and drink something. Bamboo, this is junk stuff. I was too dirty, so my hair now. The bamboo, the bamboo, the bamboo. Hi, guys, just reached home. Yes, this is my home. I want to ask my mom what she thinks about my hair, my wig. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. So, I've reached home. It takes like six, seven hours. That's it. What is that? Okay, I can name it smart. Smart and smart. Hey, camera. I came with the rain. So apparently it hasn't been raining and now it's raining. So let me help out. See the clouds, it's raining. No. So now it's rainbow in our car. Hey, k -Trail, could you congratulate me? Today I packed lightly. This bag imagine is for me and so lunch and my bag for the laptop. Yeah, that's me. One eternity later. <laughs> so hello k -Tri. welcome back to my youtube channel today's challenge it's a challenge my current location is kisi my home i'm in up country by the way in a town called kisi there's no wi-fi yes there's mobile data but i don't want to use it because it's safaricom it's really expensive so i'm gonna like today's today challenge I'm gonna be off Wi-Fi for 24 days, off Wi-Fi, off data bundles, like I'm going to be off internet for 24 hours and I'll let you know <laughs> the activities I'll be doing, if I'm going to survive it or not, like it's a Wi-Fi detox kind of video and I'm really happy because there's no temptation, no even data bundle temptation because Oh my god, you guys, if you live in Kenya, you know Safaricom bundles is super expensive. 
so wish me luck um wish me luck i'll be coming in and out to tell you my review what i think so like right now i bought like i came yesterday i bought a bundle of um i'm so ashamed to say this i bought a uh, 5gb bundle for 1000 oh my god just to upload this video and the rate at which it's in a mesa bundles is too much so this challenge is going to work pretty well and i'm going to detox as well because i find myself on my fire all the time i've already started the challenge right now it's 11 44 a.m and waking up in the village it's like we wake up at six in the morning yeah with the sun yeah so let's do this if you like this kind of video let me know like comment subscribe let me know what you think and i'm thinking of making my talkie while i'm here because as you can see in front of me there is a banana like we have a lot of matoke in Kisi. see even there is a pie by pie Six and a half hours later. my my sister clippings because that's what you do when you are you have you only you don't have wi-fi <laughs> the life already finished washing the utensils they are there. I mean the I mean the house right now. Uh the electricity is gone. We are lucky we have power in the rural areas because if you live in Kenya you know like having power is a luxury. So the power keeps on coming and going, so T V is a no. So that's an X for today's activity. So I'm trying to find things to do, actually. I think I'll, I'll like wash the house and do stuff like that. Yay! <laughs> this is around lunch I'm going to make the rema. Day two, day three, day four. Mm. Mm. Last <laughs> 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 Washington, Nini. Is only going to pronounce his English. Eh, you are 
Ya gitu. Eh, freedom of speech. Eh, di mana membiang itu begitu? Tak kemana nak nak kau argue macam? Kau ambil ayah ini. Imagine, ada ibu no, ibu no, susah tu. Ibu monta nak anandi kan noise. Anak tu banyak ibu. Ibu no, ibu monta di pi gua bawa. Pi gua, pi gua bawa ke bawah sah. Kamu siapa? Pi gua bawa. Eh, ni kau tu minum minum. Eh, form one over pada macam. Jadi dia form two. Susah tak kuna. Camera. You are going to. I'm going to Mombasa. <laughs> supposed to catch the the border the, border. Uh, the border border here, and then when I reach Nairobi, I catch the 7 p.m. flight. I'll miss you. Right? K tribe. K tribe. Mm. Like. No, I no. like. K tribe. <laughs> Subscribe. Okay. Bye. 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 Nana is gone on board. <laughs> Not really. I'm going to look at the views. This is a cow. Oh, I'm super. Oh, I'm daddy. This is a cow, my daddy. Now, I'm going to get it. Oh, I'm going to get going to give them the naipa grass. Yes, the Yeah, this is a mom. This is the mom of uh, my daddy. My mom calls this one Neosi. <laughs> That's for lunch. My, my brother's house, my uncle's house, and this is our house. And down there, like 30 minutes, you go to them. Tony. But unana mam, uskiangi mama acha tu bonye takufuata. So there's no like tap water here. So we collect rainwater and it comes to that tank. And my mom is going to the craft baby. We are going to. Unana. Uh, these are traditional burgers, traditional vegetables. They are more like herbs. Terere. In terere. Mm. This is terere. I don't know in English what it's called. Green vegetable. <laughs> here, down here, there's banana. This is kale. The cuckoo. That's maize plantation over there. There, the maize. Sosa in Kisi, it's called pumpkin leaves. We also eat them. This one is tea. Tea plantation. And they cut the things like this. There's another fruit down there. It is very sweet. Which one? 
Plus, they are like over here. This stuff is from over there. Like, yeah, there's a very sweet fruit. We have a coffee, like coffee plantation. And this is the seeds when they are, you know, as you call them. They will ripen up and then they will become a darker color. Like maize plantation. I think that's Jai Kua Bad, doesn't it? This is what, what you make ugali with when, the, when it ripens. Hmm? Cows, naipa grass. Any naipa grass? Yeah. It's expensive, yeah. Mama. Oh, una chula two two tea buds, sunda. Ah, ini tangu aje mata imbili. Hizo za juu tu. Two and a two and a half and a band. And a leaf. Aki yako kwa ngor. Hmm. Hmm. Kama chua. Africa is a desert. It's mm. all dry. Mm. So it's a lie. Mm. It's a lie. It's not true. I think okay. it's a bad. It's our green. green. Our this is our Kana. <laughs> <laughs> and we are experiencing a dry. It's a dry season and it's already green. Paratram. Coffee. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. factory, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. in a grand mm -hmm. It's a passion fruit. Yes, Yeah, if you like this kind of video, don't forget to like. Comment and subscribe to the K tribe, it's free. A uh, purple plant, the male version. If you call a male, is that eh? That's my queer male and female. Mm. They fertilize the farm with the cow dog. Mm. Or banana, mm. eh? It's a medicine to me. It's a medicine. One of my um, my pantica qua banana. <laughs> it's highly sorted. Yeah, so yeah. my mom says <laughs> it's an avocado tree. We get avocados for free here. Turn up the color yet because they have just grown. Mama this is a mango tree, baby mango tree. So the the seeds turn into this color, the red color. Yeah, I'm really bad with names. Pumpkin. All of them eat a pumpkin for the pumpkin. What? Yeah, it's around 1.40 p.m. So I'm going to make some pumpkin. Because Solan love pumpkins and I love pumpkins. Let's go and make it. So guys, I want to start a fire. Yeah. Yeah. I 
I don't know where I'll put you. I think I'm gonna put you here. The chicken and a on fire. My mama is cooking. Oh, and sorry if the quality changes. I'm using my phone because it's an effort. I'm not feeling well, guys. Not totally feeling well. And this is my outfit. Boot. That's Hello, K Tribe. It's Saturday on 20th. Yeah, a day after Good Friday. I'm not really feeling well, but I felt like I should update you. This is why I wa I chose to live in a farm. Why millennials will choose to live in a farm in Africa. I chose to live in a farm in Africa. I think this is going to be the title of this video. Because one, why I choose to live in a farm? Because my mom loves farm life. Her whole life, like since she got married, have children, she worked in Nairobi, she lived, she schooled all of us in Nairobi and then she just decided to retire at home. So this is my farm, my mom's home currently and this is my, the ancestral home of my father, great grandfather from my father's side. So yeah, it's more easy, everyone knows everyone and I like it here and I like it because it's my mom's house. It's my mom's home. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. <laughs> because anywhere your mom is, it's home. Where anywhere your, your loved ones are, it's home. Yeah. So enjoy this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I've been battling what I want to do on this whole video. But I'll keep everything I did in this video and call it why I choose to live in a farm in africa hope you enjoy and there will be many activities like cutting chicken fetching water things like that i'll just show you and if you enjoy you know what to do like comment subscribe i love you so much bye we are waiting for our motorbike but the kitambo we used to walk 45 minutes now we're going to take our motorbike to the main road for like 10 minutes okay bye